Hi, my name is Elena Suarez. I'm a natural resources specialist with Broward Parks, and today I'm gonna to take you behind the scenes on our bat monitoring project. So the bat monitoring project we're doing is in conjunction with FWC, Florida Fish and Wildlife, and they were gracious enough to lend us a bat detector, um, which is an acoustic monitoring device that picks up bat call frequencies. Today we're setting up the acoustic monitoring device at Markham Park. Um, we selected a site next to a pond behind me that um, has good bat activity and we are hoping to capture the Florida bonneted bat because we're so close to the Everglades, uh, which is a known area that the bonneted bat has been detected, um, as well as other bat species that are present at the site. There has been little detections throughout Broward County, so the more data we can find on this species, the better we can help to preserve it. So this is our bat acoustic monitoring device. Um, So this is the device itself, and what it does is it we attach a microphone to it, um, which is right here, and we're going to set up this pole and attach the microphone to the top of the pole, and we're going to leave it set up for 10 nights, and at sunset it'll start recording the bat calls, and um, after the 10 day sampling period, then we take it back to the office, we download the data, and we put it through the software that will tell us exactly what bat species is calling. This is just the tripod to hold up that pole that I'm gonna attach the microphone on. Um, you wanna try and get the microphone as high as you can. I'm gonna use these zip ties to attach the microphone. And we wanna kinda of put it at a little bit of an angle in case it does rain so that the, the water will kind of run off the microphone. So I have the SD cards right in here. And I'm going to attach the microphone. Okay. So now I'm going to just make sure that the detector is not giving me any errors so that way I know it's gonna collect the data. So now that all of that is set, I turn the program start on and it says it's gonna to go to sleep until 1731, so sun, an hour before sunset, and that's it. It will collect data for the next 10 nights. 